Chris, we will see you then. Thank you. Today in Frankfurt, Governor Bevin held a ceremonial signing for Noah's Bill, a law designed to help children battling a serious condition. Mike Meyer was in the Capitol today, and he talked with Noah, the boy who inspired this bill. Yesterday was my birthday, and today was the best birthday gift. Noah Greenhill turned 10 years old yesterday. Today, he received a gift like no other, leaving big smiles on the faces of he and his family. How excited are you today? Very excited because I was actually getting to hold my very own bill. Noah's bill, also known as Senate Bill 193, was officially signed into law earlier this month. However, Governor Matt Bevin held a ceremonial signing this morning with Noah and his family on hand. You've been an inspiration to many, many people. Uh, and it's a special day. It really is, and I'm honored to be here. Noah suffers from a chronic immune system disease called eosinophilic esophagitis. It's a condition that attacks his esophagus, making it hard for him to eat most foods. We started recognizing problems when he was three months old. His dad, Eddie Greenhill, says in order to get nutrition, Noah has to drink a special formula that costs them $40 a day. But with this new bill, insurance companies are now required to pay for the special formula, not just for Noah, but for any child who suffers from the rare genetic condition. We wanted to stand up and, and make a fight for all of them as well as ourselves and so that they don't have to go through the same struggles that we did. I'm very happy for the other people because it's going to help them very well. In Frankfurt, Mike Byer, WKYT. And about 200 children in Kentucky have the condition Noah suffers from.